Hello, my name is Walter Unglob, and this is Geometry Formulas for Finding the Radius. If I have a circle in the xy plane and I want to solve for the radius, I have to be given some information. I can consider the relationship between the x component of this radial vector going from the center of the circle, the origin, and a point on the circle, and that relationship is given for x as x equals the radius times cosine of the angle theta that is made between this vector and the x-axis. And likewise, I have y is equal to r times sine of theta. So if I know the value of x and y at this coordinate point, then I can solve for theta, and it's going to be equal to the arc tangent of y over x, which represents the slope of this line. And I can use either of these equations to solve for the radius. So using the top equation, I have r is equal to my value of x divided by cosine theta, where for theta I would plug in this expression because I know my y and I know my x. Alternatively, we can look at the equation for the circle in standard form, which is given by x minus x naught squared plus y minus y naught squared is equal to the radius squared. When I solve this equation of the circle for r, I'm interested only in positive values, so I have r is equal to positive square root of x minus x naught squared plus y minus y naught squared. In this case, for this example, the center of the circle is located at the origin, so my x naught and my y naught are 0 and 0, respectively. So this equation simplifies to r is equal to the square root of x squared plus y squared which merely represents an application of the Pythagorean theorem for this little triangle right here. So if I know my x and my y value along the circle, then I can calculate the radius r. My name is Walter Unglob, and this is Geometry Formulas for Finding the Radius.